Hey guys, this is Andy with InfiniGeek, and today we're going to quickly go over how to transfer files from a Nexus 5, or any smartphone really, to a PC. Here we go. To do this, you're obviously going to need a smartphone. I have the Nexus 5. You might have a different Android smartphone. Also, if you don't have a wireless network, you will need a cord like this, which is just a USB cord. I'm going to use my power cord that came with my Nexus 5, which also doubles as a USB connection. So, first, I'm going to plug this end into my phone. You will also need a computer, of course, and here, I just plug in, just plug in the other end of your USB cord here. And then wait for the prompt on your computer. It also says connected as media device. If your phone doesn't want to connect to your PC, then what you need to do is you need to go to your storage settings. So go to storage, and this little menu up here, USB computer connection. You want to click that and make sure you have media devices checked right here. Make sure that's checked. Now you're basically using your Android device as a media storage, just like if you inserted a flash drive or a USB stick or something like that. So it pops up like this on your PC. Just go in and then you can find the files that you need to move over. What I like to do is move over my pictures and to find those you just go in DCIM folder Click on that, and then you've got all your photos and stuff that that you get from different stuff like Facebook, browser, etc. The camera one is what we want, so we go into the camera, and then it populates all the pictures that you've taken. So basically, I just do a quick control A for this, select all of the pictures, and then I'll just copy them over to my computer and delete them. And Basically, you're connected to your phone like a storage device, so you can do other stuff like install APK files or whatever whatever you would usually want to do with your phone connected to your computer. The other way to transfer files to your computer is through your wireless network. So to do that, you want to download a file manager app like ES File Explorer. I downloaded this one and I really like it, but there's tons of apps like this, so feel free to download the one that you want. But Basically what this app allows you to do is to use your phone's file system. And what you want to do if you have a wireless network set up is go to LAN. And then you'll see your computer pop up. And then here you can just navigate to where you need to to move your files over. So this is just a quick and easy way to get your files moved over to your computer without having to connect through the USB. I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you want more tips, then subscribe, and I'll talk to you in the next video.